Yatin and the orange tree. Yatin Indra sat under the orange tree with his grandson. He stood up and picked an orange from the tree. He cut it into two pieces and gave half of it to his grandson to eat. He watched the little boy eat the fruit and smile. Did I ever tell you my story about this tree? Yatin asked. No, his grandson said. Well, let me tell you. And Yatin began his story. It was a hot sunny day. I was a little boy like you. And I sat under an orange tree to keep cool from the sun. I looked up and saw a big juicy orange. I knew it was wrong because it wasn't our tree. But I was so thirsty. I picked the fruit and ate it. It was delicious. I looked back and at the tree and picked another. Then I felt a big hand on my shoulder. I looked around and saw the scariest man in the village. It was Gautam Khan, the meanest farmer and enemy of all the child, the children. I'm sorry, I said. It is just one orange. But Khan didn't want to listen. He told me to wait and left his dog to watch me. Let's see what the police officer has to say. He said, you stay here, I'm going to get him. I didn't know what to do. The police officer was coming. I was in trouble. I couldn't go anyway. Not with that dog there. I thought about my parents. They would be angry. I thought about the orange. It was bad to take them. I knew it was wrong, but they were so delicious. Then Gautam Khan returned. He had the police officer with him. This is the boy, he said, and pointed at me. He stole my orange. Is this true? The police officer asked. Yes, it is, I said. I know it was wrong, I add, but is this But is it so hot and the orange were so juicy? The police officer looked at Gautam Khan. Do you really want me to take this boy to the police station? He asked. The boy is sorry. Gautam Khan looked at me. He wasn't so angry. Well, he said, the boy could work for me for the rest of the day. What do you think? The police officer asked me. Yes, I said, of course. 